Today let's take a quick look at the template designer in .cms. Into the backend of the .cms and from the browser drop-down menu select templates. Here we are presented a list of templates that are in your system. You can see that we have two types of icons. We have the new designer template icon as well as the old or advanced template icon. Even with the introduction of the template designer, we still do support the code template or the what we're now calling the advanced templates. So as you can see here, we have two choices to adding a template, and these are permissioned individually. So you can have access to the template designer, or you can have access to add advanced templates to the system. Let's click on template designer. And we're now presented with a graphical user interface that's going to allow us to build templates without knowing any HTML code. Let's title our template. We've also introduced the concept of themes. And what we can do here is we can actually choose from the themes that are in our host. Um, these themes are actually stored inside a folder called application themes on your root host or the root of the host. Um, you can add themes to your site across hosts. Um, we can also choose whether we want our site to be width of the site to be responsive or 100% width. We can choose whether we would like a sidebar or not. Um, a sidebar typically would be used for a side navigation. The body of the template we can actually add rows and each row can be split in several different ways. In each of these columns, we'll need to add containers in which we will place content in. As you can see, the default container is not included in the list. The system is preventing us from adding the same container twice to a template. Under the Properties tab, we can add a description or a screenshot for the template. You can also preview your template in the different mobile devices. This is what your page would look like on the iPhone resolution. As you can see, our template is using a responsive design. Save your template and you're ready to build web pages.